welcome to my November favorites. I have a lot more favorites than this month than I initially thought I would. So I'm gonna try to get through them as quickly as I can. I don't wanna bore anybody, but I want I want to be thorough with this, so let's get started. My first favorite of the month is Nine Zero's Octorog. I picked this up in October, and I picked this up, I was actually debating whether or not I wanted to get KB Shimmer's uh, Lady in the Vamp or if I wanted to get Octorok from Nine Zero. I ended up getting the Nine Zero, as you can see, and I'm happy that I did because I hadn't tried Nine Zero until I made that order. This is just, it's just so beautiful. It's got a re really dark, like, burgundy base and it has gold holographic glitter and you can see it and it just it looks so so good and i think it's just perfect perfect for the fall season my next favorite is a favorite from previous months and that is i dream of jean genie from wet n wild you can no longer pick this up you might be able to find it in a d sash but it is very difficult to get your hands on currently this is just a denim like gray blue cadet blue with gold glitter uh, very unique coming from a mainstream brand and I just wish that Wet n Wild would continue bringing out nail polish collections because I think that they do them very well. The next favorite is also a favorite from previous months and that is Susie and the Arctic Fox. This is a very, very dark polish. It is very chic though. I do find it to be chic. Uh, and it's also very easy to apply for me. This one is opaque in two coats and it's just a polish that um, it really does scream fall to me. I think it's perfect for the season. My last nail polish favorite of the month is Sally Hansen's Heavy Metal. This is a taupey gray. It definitely stands out amongst my entire collection because this is actually a color I don't have too many of, if I have any at all. So this was a fantastic palette cleanser um, and I loved the Manny. I love the way that I wore the Manny because I did incorporate some stamping with this one uh, and this one was another two coat polish. My next favorite is a gel polish. You guys saw the video. I mean, I guess if you chose to click on the video, you saw the video. I did a, an at home gel manicure. Madam Glam sent me an entire kit to do that, but I got to pick the polishes that I got and the one, one of the polishes that I picked was Spike, Spiked Cotton Candy and I love this. It just, it was so... It was so fun to wear and I can't deny, I cannot deny how glossy gel nails look and I think that's what I loved most about this manicure. Now we're gonna move on into some more nail care items and the first one is Nail Teaks Formula 2 Plus. I talked about this months ago. You guys know I was dealing with some splitting on my thumbnail. I still have that issue, um, but I still do use the Nail Teaks. Now I use this all the time. Every time I change my manicure, I always use this as my base coat. I haven't had issues with peeling. It hasn't yellowed my nails at all. The only issue with this is that it, it is very expensive. So if you are looking for this, I would say just buy it online because it is a lot cheaper to get it online. And my last favorites of the month are actually the Noodles Cuticle Oils. I actually have three of these. One of them's in the, my bag though, so I just left it there. But this one right here is monkey farts. I don't, I don't know. It smells like Runt's banana candy. That's what it, that's what it smells like to me. I don't, maybe that's just me. And the other one is apple cobbler. This just smells like fall. It smells like it smells so, so good. It really does smell like the fall time. And so I've been using this every time, every time I change my manicures before I even put on nail teaks, I always apply some oil just to moisturize the skin around my nails and my nails themselves. And I, I've been enjoying it. I've been enjoying it a lot. And I like the fact that it is in a roller ball. You don't get too much. Uh, I mean, if you wanna apply more, you just keep rolling it on and you can get more, but it doesn't flood and get all over the place if you don't want it to, which is something I really appreciate. So those are my favorites of the month. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know when your favorites were. Let me know, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.